in this presentation i am going to explain what is vienna convention for the protection of the ozone layer let's start the vienna convention for the protection of the ozone layer is an international environmental agreement signed in 1985 in vienna austria the treaty was signed to reduce the production of chlorofluorocarbons because the chlorofluorocarbons were the main chemical agents depleting the ozone layer which resulted in an increased threat of skin cancer let me tell you what is chlorofluorocarbons the chlorofluorocarbons are stable molecules composed of carbon fluorine and chlorine that were used prominently in products such as refrigerators let's come to the agreement it is not a binding agreement and it works as a framework for the international efforts to protect the ozone layer the vienna convention provided the framework necessary to create regulatory measures in the form of montreal protocol I will discuss Montreal Protocol in the next presentation. Let's move on. Treaty signed. The treaty was signed on 22nd March 1985 in Vienna, Austria. The Vienna Convention was the first convention of any kind to be signed by all countries in the world, taking effect in 1988 and reaching universal ratification in 2009. Let's move on. official languages of the treaty the official languages of the vienna convention are arabic chinese english french russian and spanish ratifiers the treaty has been ratified by 197 states including the holy see new and the cook islands let's move on objectives of the treaty The main objectives of the Vienna Convention for the protection of the ozone layer are to observe, research and exchange information on the effects of human activities on the ozone layer and to adopt measures to combat those activities responsible for ozone depletion. The Vienna Convention is still making progress. the member countries meet once every 3 years to make decisions on important issues including research and systematic observations as well as financial and administrative matters that's it for now we will come back with a different topic till then keep watching narvi academy